Who am I? How about we start with who I was? Growing up, I was the baddest motherfucker on my block. It was drink, fuck, or fight for years. I had no direction in my life except for the desire to create havoc. And then one day, my dad sent me a self-help book called The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People. And that changed everything for me. That book taught me that I could have anything I wanted if I just took responsibility for my life. I could be a great leader. I could be a real estate developer. I could even become a millionaire. And I did. You see, success demands that we find our mission and we go for it without reservation and without apology. When I changed my mission from knucklehead to entrepreneur, everything fell into place. My primary mission is to be a wildly successful real estate investor, and I am. My secondary mission is to teach you my path, and I will. Once I discovered my mission, I crafted a five-year plan. I read my goals daily, I visualized success, and I read everything that I could on real estate. And then I started a construction company at the age of 21. I made friends with people in the real estate business. And then I made the best investment of my life. I invested in myself. I maxed out my credit card to go to a four-day boot camp about real estate investing. And let me tell you, people close to me were telling me that I was crazy, or that I got scammed. But five weeks later, I wholesaled my first deal and earned 13 grand with only a few hours worth of work. At that time, that was more money than I had ever made in my life. And don't worry, I'm gonna show you how to do it too. I continued flipping houses and I started buying property. I was off to the races as a real estate developer. Within a few years, my company grew to over 50 employees doing about $10 million a year in business. I built high-end homes in Bel Air, Malibu, Beverly Hills, and other luxury locations. I built shopping centers in LA, and then I got into condo development. I made a ton of money for myself and even more importantly for my investors. And in less than five years, I had accomplished everything that I had written down. And then the crash happened. During the recession, there was no real estate development going on and it was tough. But my buddies who owned apartments were crushing it and I knew that I wanted that. I knew that I needed to build a solid foundation of cash flow to bulletproof my financial future. So I did what every deal maker does in the face of adversity. I adapted. But the first thing I had to do was admit to myself that I didn't know jack shit about owning apartments. And so to learn the apartment business, I had to get a mentor. So for the next whole year, I traveled across the United States, following my mentor city to city, learning the apartment business inside and out. And after my apprenticeship, I went to Texas to make my stake. I broke into the market and over the next few years, I bought and sold hundreds of apartment units. I raised millions of dollars from individual investors and I made them a ton of money. Today the market has come full circle and I'm back to developing some really incredible properties like this one in Newport, California. This is a 25,000 square foot lot on the water with the largest private dock on the western seaboard. And yes, I am bragging about the size of my dock. My firm purchased this lot for $11.4 million just last year, and I'll be building two 10,000 square foot homes here, and the project will likely gross $50 million in the next 16 months. Dealmaker Society is all about showing you how to think big so that you can do big deals like this, and perhaps we can even do some deals together. Look, I'll always buy cash flowing apartments because they're safe and secure and they generate a good cash flow. And I'll always be a real estate developer because this is my passion. And now I've turned my attention to accomplishing my secondary mission, teaching you my path to success. Because after all, real estate is a team sport. Look, I'm gonna teach you all the techniques about real estate investing. Whether you wanna add a little cash flow to your life, flip a few houses, or go big time and do giant deals, I'm gonna show you how. But we're gonna take this one step further and give you the intangibles that no guru ever does. I'm gonna teach you how to market, how to sell, how to negotiate, how to manage finances, and how to raise private equity. You can know all the real estate tips and tricks in the world, but if you don't have a foundation of these five skills, then you will fail. Deal makers are all about mastering real estate and mastering yourself. Welcome to the Dealmaker Society.